Well, hi everyone, I'm CBS 19 Chief Meteorologist Brett Anthony. We had scattered showers and thunderstorms develop and some of us are getting some much needed rain. In fact, some of us are getting downpours right now. These scattered showers and thunderstorms will last till about sunset and then they'll fade away. One particular area that I want to point out here is up toward Marion and Harrison County over toward Jefferson up to the northeast or over toward or city and Dangerfield. That's a very slow moving thunderstorm and that could put down one and a half to two inches of rainfall. So that a heavy thunderstorm producer with maybe some 40 mile an hour winds. Besides the thunderstorms, we're back to heat again tomorrow. Another heat advisory from 11 a.m. until 7 o'clock. Heat values could go up to 108. The impacts, heat and humidity may cause some heat illness. Here's the hour by hour forecast we talked about, but the potential to see a heat index close to 108 degrees that would happen between 3 and 4 o'clock as the air temperature climbs up close to 101 to about 103 tomorrow. It's going to be a very hot day and you can see area wide. The heat index at 5 o'clock is solidly right there where we need it to be for a heat advisory at 105. In fact, some of the hotter readings are showing up in Athens and Palestine right around 106 over deep east Texas about 104 to 105 and into Saturday more of the same that heat index pops right back up into that heat advisory area again so we may have another heat advisory for Saturday playground tomorrow if you're going to go to the playground go in the morning noon and four o'clock that equipment will get simply too hot to safely play on I'd wait till evening after that here's your three-day forecast long view up to 103 tomorrow Nacogdoches up to 100 under mostly sunny skies. Saturday, sunny, 103 in Longview, 101 in Nacogdoches. And Sunday, scattered thunderstorms in Longview. Nacogdoches likely stays dry Sunday with a high temperature at both locations right around 100 degrees. Forecast high on Saturday, 104. That would set a new record high. The existing record high, 103, set back in 1930. And the forecasted high of 102 on Sunday falls one degree shy of the record high set back in 2012. Just a hot stretch. Current burn bans in Texas. We did have uh, Panola County added to that. Also Harrison County, now Cherokee County, and a number of other counties into East Texas. All right, here's tomorrow afternoon. It's plain hot and dry. A couple of isolated showers possible. I think less coverage than we're seeing today. Saturday is sunny and hot with that potential record high. Then this front bound, this frontal boundary slips into the area on Sunday. And look at this. Scattered showers and a few thunderstorms. That front is stalling, so the shower and thunderstorm chances will stick around with us right into Monday. Not much rain, though. Saturday and Sunday we could see, or Sunday and Monday we could see, maybe up to a half inch of rain in some locations. Otherwise, it's less than that, closer to a tenth of an inch of rain. And over the next seven days, just about a tenth to a half inch of rain. Tonight, very warm and humid, down to 77 for the overnight low. Otherwise, clear to partly cloudy skies with light and variable winds. Baylor Scott and White, Texas Spine Joint Hospital, seven-day forecast. Heat advisory tomorrow, the hottest day yet, up to 103. Saturday, new record high of 104. Afternoon, shower and thunderstorm chances showing up Sunday. Then look how much cooler Monday, 92 for the high. Deep East Texas has the best chance of rain Tuesday with a high of 94, and then it heats up and dries out as we head into the middle of next week.